Hi, I'm Danielle. I do too much. I like hair, talking, cosplay, music, art, and stuff. There, and welcome to Sarbobi. <laughs> I'm Danielle, your resident weirdo, and welcome to the weirdness. Big shout out to my patrons on Patreon. They help me do this full time, and I appreciate their direct support so much. If you'd like to join the Deluxe Weirdness on Patreon, click here, and I'll see you in the Deluxe Weirdness with behind the scenes and special exclusive videos and a special guest that's right there. <laughs> Who could it be? So it's fall. And as a summer lover, I'm fine with that. I don't want any more summertime. I don't want any more warmth. I love fall. I love fall. Fluff Nugget now needs different things. I've noticed in the last couple of weeks, uh, Fluff Nugget hasn't been like as springy. Either she's over moisturized and shrinky or like non-cooperative and a little stiff or she's under moisturized and really dry and tight and like almost like coarse feeling. I was like, are my hair strands thickening? Oh wait, they're just under moisturized. Okay. And right on time, Matrix came and helped me out. Matrix has deeply moisturizing products and oh, <laughs> they're right here. So Matrix actually specializes in all hair types. What I've tried for the last couple of weeks is A Curl Can Dream, their curly hairline and Oh, you know how I feel about a pun. So I was already down. <laughs> and all of these products, these six professional products are professional level. Uh, thank you. <laughs> so Matrix actually worked over the course of three years with top curl specialists. The all new A Curl Can Dream system defines curls, coils, and keeps hair moisturized with no flaking and no crunching. It's infused with Manuka honey extract, not including the lightweight oil though. And it's a natural humectant, which is known to moisturize hair, which means your hair will be soft and moisturized. A Curl Can Dream system is free from silicones, parabens, mineral oils, petrolatum, and paraffin. The co-wash, the mask, the cream, the gel, and the oil are free from sulfates. And the fragrances include rose, peony, sea salt, jasmine, sheer amber, creamy white woods. And let me tell you, they smell great. So let's roll the footage and see how my wash day went. <laughs> Step one, a Curl Can Dream shampoo. This removes buildup and oils and uh, styling products. And as a person who uses, you know, heavy styling products, uh, cause I have tight, weatherable, very sensitive hair, I'd be putting real heavy stuff on my hair every week. So I need something that's going to get it out. As per usual, I focused all of my shampoo on the scalp and let any other product work its way to the rest of my strand. This shampoo lathers quite a bit, so it wasn't a problem. My hair felt very clean, but not stripped. It felt like, hey, we took off all the things, but we didn't take the soul out of your hair. We didn't um, drag it through the desert for 40 days and 40 nights. We didn't send it any letters from Sally Mae. You know, we didn't remove its soul, you, you know? I moved my microphone. I, I realized how much of the frame it was taking up and I did something about it. Moving on, step two, a Curl Can Dream co-wash. This can be used in between wash days to gently clean without stripping the natural oils, but um, I personally kind of used it as a conditioner this time because I just used the cleansing shampoo and it, ooh, this is a thick, creamy co-wash. I was very surprised by the texture of it. Uh, I expected something a little more watery. When it came out so thick, I was like, yes. <laughs> I have 4C hair, I have naturally very dry hair, so I feel very like seen when something, something in the line has to have some thickness to it and the co-wash, uh, it provided that. I'm really impressed with this co-wash. It's, it's heavily moisturizing. That thickness, it's, uh, it's pulling its weight. <laughs> I also use the co-wash as a co-wash in between wash days, uh, but I didn't film that. <laughs> but it worked very well and it helped me stretch out that week just stretch it out a little more. I wasn't ready to shampoo, but it worked very well as a co-wash as well as a conditioner. Step three, a Curl Can Dream Rich Mask. So this is what I consider the deep conditioner of the line. 
You place it in your hair for a minimum of five minutes. I was like, haha, 20 minutes with heat, please. Again, I was very surprised with the texture of the rich mask. It was thinner than I thought it would be. But then when I actually put it on my hair, my hair said, thanks. Drink it right up. And then it did that thing that I love so much when my hair feels like, the only way I can describe it is like, <laughs> my, <laughs> My hair felt like the texture of a muffin. <laughs> it felt like really moist and like dense and like buttery. Like when fluff nugget becomes fluff muffin, things are going very well. <laughs> and again, I've been working through like the fall transition area in my hemisphere. So I haven't felt fluff muffin in quite some time and it was really encouraging like oh thank goodness something that really is rich and nourishing to my hair um and and so quickly too i didn't have to like work it in it actually was being absorbed before i could even get to my heat receptacle so that is always a good sign so i'm loving the rich mask so now it was time to style before I do my blowout routine, linked here, I always uh, put in a leave-in conditioner or some kind of cream to protect my hair because once it's dry, it's it's your hairs versus the weather and uh, pollution and dirt. So what ended up happening is I put in the A Curl Can Dream moisturizing cream. I really love this stuff. This and the Rich Cream are actually my two favorite products. Light but nourishing texture. As with the rest of these products, my hair drank it up immediately, but then also felt like strong and protected. I feel like I locked in all of the work I just did and all of the conditioning I just did and like all the love and preparation. And it, it felt like my hair was both protected and moisturized, but the real kicker came in when I did my blowout routine and this happened when my hair was all of these things, malleable, soft and stretched. Those of you with a challenging head of hair, particularly 4C, will understand how incredible that combination of things is. You either get, it's, it's like that chart in college where it's like good grades, sleep and fun, and you can only pick two. <laughs> well, for me, malleability, moisture and stretch, I can usually only pick one and a half. With this, I didn't have to choose. This is where the Manuka honey really came in. I could really feel the moisture and I still do. So I blew out my hair using my Revlon. Same one, always. That's what works for my hair. That's what works for Fluff Nugget. And in general, I like to pack as much moisture into my hair and then blow it out so it will maintain that moisture. These are the things that work for me. If you have similar hair to me, um, please check that out. I have 4C hair all over my head. I have medium porosity. I have fine strands. I have mong length lidium. <laughs> and at this point, I have no idea what density I have. And then I did a fun new funky thing. I put the gel on all my edges underneath my afro. And I have to say, I'm gonna keep doing that. I did this for one reason and one reason only, to protect my buckshots. When I sleep at night, I have on a bonnet. And where does my bonnet go? Very squarely on all of my edges. And so I've noticed them feeling a little more robust. They don't have as much drama going on. And I really like that. If, if you're interested, go for it, see what happens. But then on top of that, literally, I, <laughs> I put the A Curl Can Dream Light Hold Oil. So I actually chose to put this on on top of wet hair that I just put the moisturizing cream onto. So here are my honest thoughts about the Acurl Can Dream system. Yeah, this is gonna be my fall and very possibly winter wash day routine, whole thing. I'm a huge fan and I highly recommend it. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and link this in the description box. So friggin' thanks for hanging out with me during my wash day. It's been a while since I've done a wash day routine. Uh, big shout out to my patrons on Patreon. If you are so inclined to the deluxe weirdness, uh, I've left a link in the description box and also click here. 
Uh, if you'd like to be in the credits, uh, the Starry Spaniel tier is for you. And um, thank you so much for joining me. I upload on Tuesdays with content like this. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. This has been me, Danielle, your resident weirdo, Star Puppy, signing out. Say it with me now, Star Puppy. Away! Don't forget to like, share, subscribe if you enjoyed the video.